This video is all about you snooker players that wear glasses. Now I'm one of those players. I have to wear glasses. And in my video number 78, I think it's entitled Eyesight Matters, I talk at length about snooker glasses. One aspect that I didn't really enlarge upon is the angle of the head, right? Now that can change with age. Now if you think about me specifically, I've been involved in sport all my life, as I've had several injuries, shoulder and neck injuries, etc. I have developed slight spondylosis, shall we say. Through age, right, I can't lift my head up quite as I as somebody with more mobility. I was trying, uh, trying to get snooker glasses as small as I possibly could. Now I've just had a new prescri uh, prescription and I need to get stronger glasses. So I contacted Chris Chetty again. He runs snookerspecs.com, as I've mentioned before. I've also mentioned that he's an optician and a very good snooker player. So he knows what he's talking about. And I was asking him about why the angle of the head is so significant when we talk about spectacles, specifically snooker spectacles. One of the things that he said to me when he, he took a video, a picture of me from side on, he noticed that my head was more like that. The, the, my nose on the cue exaggerating the point, which means that I have to lift my eyes up higher than somebody whose facial position or head position starts off there. So if you've got your head up quite high, you're looking through, shall we say, the center of the lens. Because my nose is almost on the cue, so to speak, I have to lift my eyes higher so I'm looking through a more higher part of the lens. So the end result of that is I have to have a slightly larger lens. I wasn't aware of that until Chris pointed it out to me. And the one thing I want to say, okay, I'm advertising Chris products, but I'll bet you that normal opticians don't know that either. Yeah, so just be careful if you need snooker glasses, do you have a stiff neck? Can you get your head up uh, as you would like to? Or is it a bit more like that where you're further down? And if it is, you will have to lift your eyes higher up in the socket. So you will need possibly slightly larger lenses. I just want you, if you are a snooker player that wears glasses, to be aware of those points. 